look what just arrived in the mail. I hope it works when I use it for video and possibly for videoing outside. We'll see. So this is the specifications. Actually seeing the holder is better, but that is the clamp for the phone. So I'll be using this today to do my filming. The reason I wanted to get this is because if I wanted to set up in a different location in the house, I could just move it or take it with me outside. So we'll see. So this is the clip that holds the phone. This is a wire, and then there is a wire that I could plug in. I have this connected. It unscrews and it clamps on to wherever you want to put it. And this is pretty long, this uh, scope, and it seems very sturdy. So when I'm painting over here, it seems a little sturdier than this little thing I have rigged up with tape. And that's a friend of mine. <laughs> this was her Christmas card, Eliza. She's a great photographer. <laughs> and she does a lot of family and dogs. Let's see. There's a little commercial. She's fantastic. She's one of my photographers. Anyway, so I will be setting up for my painting. I think I'm going to be doing these radishes. I haven't gotten to my little area to paint in a few days, so I've been wanting to. Things Sometimes things get in the way, but I always come back to it. I had a sketch pad. Set. These will set up. You can fill up your dropper and use this to kind of squirt the water. <laughs> Whee! Squirt it on, on some of your paints. We'll have a little water fight. No, 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 not around your paints. Not in your work area. Now I have my paper. Let's see what size it is. A little shy, 3.75. It's a little shy of four and slightly shy of six inches there. And it's five and seven eighths. I had to go count. I had to like look really close to see that. But there it is, horizontally. And I'm going to start sketching. This is the first time I was able to get radishes with the leaves on it. So far, I've only been able to buy them in my supermarket in a plastic bag. But I did go to a smaller supermarket, not really very close by me, but they had these bunch of radishes. I already ate some too. I love radishes. They're really good with butter, which I may have mentioned. I know the French like to eat them with butter. I was once there and I saw this big ad for someone cutting, you know, it was a picture of someone eating a radish with butter on it. And growing up, I had French friends and they they like to eat it that way. Always when I think of France, I can't help but think of the Coneheads from Saturday Night Live, SNL, as it's called now. And they had the Coneheads when they were asked, they were from another planet, and they'd always say to their neighbors, we're from France, like little um, robots, and always makes me laugh. You can look up, probably on YouTube, you can find the Coneheads from Saturday Night. These little squiggly, I don't know if they're roots. Would you call them roots? Radishes are interesting because they kind of have that little bit of bitterness to them. It's an acquired taste, but I really love them. When I have a lot of green in a painting, if I'm doing a landscape, I like to blend some red into the color, whether I blend it right into the green or put it next to it. So you always, it's a good trick to kind of calm down a color when they're opposite colors on the color wheel, softening the color. Yeah. I'm putting a little ultramarine in there, darken up or put shadows in the green. I also use that to darken up it, uh, my browns, good painting trees. The roots actually, I made them red, but they actually have a lot of white running through them. They get light, maybe I'll add a little yellow in them. Some yellow cadmium here.
Okay, so I have that. And write it in script. Today is Bastille Day, and I honored it by talking about butter on radishes in France. So check out the Coneheads on Saturday Night Live, early episodes, and try some butter on radishes, or just have some radishes. Much better for your diet. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Okay, have a great day.